Hey, what is up ladies and gentlemen? How are you all doing? So, I've been getting a few comments on some of my reaction videos telling me that I should be tolerant or open-minded to other ideas. Well, not open-minded, but I should be tolerant to opposing ideas. And, I mean, that sounds reasonable, being tolerant to somebody else's ideas, but then, you know, I kind of think about it a little bit. I know I might be overreacting, I've thought about that, which is why I've meditated this thought a little bit and I'm not making a reaction video or a video about this topic fresh from, from my emotions. You know, I sat on it a little bit and like I said, you know, at first that seems like a reasonable thing to say, be tolerant of other people's ideas. Then as I thought about it, I'm thinking of all the videos I've made in reaction to other people's videos, discussing other ideologies, discussing other people, and I'm trying to figure out how am I not tolerant of other people's ideas? What have I said that suggested I'm not tolerant? Because to me, when I think of being tolerant to other people's ideas, I'm not censoring other people. I'm letting them speak their ideas, and I'm not telling them that they sh- I'm not, I'm not forcing them to not have an idea. So the only logical conclusion that I can come up with is that it's a response to a video I'm making and they happen, or a point I'm making, and they happen to disagree with what I'm saying, so they're telling me to be tolerant of other ideas. That almost sounds, I'm not trying to play the victim. I'm not saying people are trying to censor me. I'm just trying to figure out tolerance. Tolerant to other people's ideas. So by me having an opposing opinion and voicing my opinion on the internet, on YouTube, uh, reacting to a video of somebody with a different political opinion, then I, is that intolerance? Is that intolerance? I don't know, I guess it is. I think some ideas are stupid. Uh, socialism, I think. Socialism is stupid. I think forced socialism is stupid. I think single-payer healthcare is stupid. I think welfare is stupid. I think food stamps are stupid. I think closed borders are stupid. I think Donald Trump's wall is stupid. I think communism is stupid. I think the Young Turks are stupid. Does that mean I'm not tolerant to their beliefs? No, it doesn't. I'm completely tolerant to the beliefs. I just think their beliefs are stupid and I feel like I have a right to tell people that their opinion is stupid. And I don't just use ad hominem and say that your opinion is stupid. I say that your opinion is stupid, I tell you why. I give my opinion why I try to back up what I say with facts, statistics, any sort of evidence in the real world, any sort of studies or just examples to back up my opinion, my claims. I try to present facts. Um, yeah, so I don't get how I'm not tolerant to other people's views. It al It's almost kind of like when butthurt TYT fanboys make fun of my voice, call me names, uh, mention my subscriber count when they're commenting on my video. They hardly ever bring up any actual points or refute anything I say. They say I didn't make any points and then insult me, which is almost like what the statement or it's to me it's the same thing as saying you should be tolerant to other people's opinions just because I gave a reaction to somebody else's thoughts I know I'm going I'm kind of repeating things over and over again I'm being redundant but I'm just trying to wrap my mind around that statement when I claim that I'm not tolerant to other people's ideas. It didn't trigger me. I'm not triggered. I'm just trying to think about when I've been intolerant to people's ideas. Because intolerance doesn't mean you don't accept. Tolerance means that you allow it to exist. You don't oppress something or somebody based on behavior. And I don't think giving my opinion is necessarily oppression or you know being intolerant I accept other people's ideas I understand that they're out there and that they probably always will be and I'm using my ideas to call your ideas stupid when comparing it to my ideas I don't know it's almost like the real meaning behind be tolerant to other people's ideas is I disagree with you and I think you should consider my idea which I do consider other people's ideas I watch videos I disagree with all the time and sometimes I make video responses for this channel so I'm always going to give my opinion on topics whether on topics discussing 
politics, culture, and everything in between that. And I will insult other people's ideas because I think other people's ideas are stupid. I'm tolerant of them. I allow them to exist because I don't get to oppress anybody or use force to silence somebody. I am willing to engage in political discourse and have an honest conversation with you. So, I mean, if any of you can call out, call me out on me saying that I'm tolerant to other people's ideas, go for it. Give me an example of me being intolerant to other people's ideas. I don't think it's unreasonable to say that, yeah, I'm going to get a little condescending when talking about my ideas because I'm passionate about my ideas and I think my ideas are right. I am biased to my ideas. I am biased against your ideas. If you are a socialist, a communist, or any other platform, or you hold any other belief that takes away liberty or freedom, I'm pretty opinionated, and I'm always going to be opinionated, but I don't think opinionated, being opinionated, and being intolerant are the same thing. I think tolerance is willing to accept or coming to the realization that people disagree with you, and I'm willing to have a political discourse, I'm willing to have an economic discourse, I'm willing to have discourse about my beliefs, and I'm willing to listen to what you have to say and refute what you have to say at the same time. And honestly, I think if you hear somebody reacting to an opinion that you agree with and they disagree with the opinion that you agree with, meaning they disagree with you, and you tell them that they should be tolerant or open-minded to your opinion, it's just another way of saying that everybody should think like you. It's basically a form of cultural Marxism, and if you disagree with me, you can go ahead and disagree with me in the comments section below and have political discourse with me. I will respond to you. I will allow your comments to be in my comment section for other people people to either read or to discuss and reply to you and you can have debates you can stroke each other's egos and say I agree with you you're right I have not blocked a single comment on any of my videos whatsoever there are comments that I ignore I don't respond to I even approve the comments that insult me whether it be my voice um, the way I talk or just insult me in general, I allow those comments. I keep them up because it shows that you're the intolerant one, that you're the one who doesn't have an actual response to what I'm saying. You can't refute a single point that I have, so you resort to arguing and, sorry, you don't resort to arguing. You resort to insulting me instead of responding to my points, and I let those comments stay so people can see the type of person that you are. <laughs>